Welcome, my friends, to Need for Speed Heat. It's finally here. We're jumping straight in to Waffle 86 News. Here we go. Oh, yeah, it is. There's the pole star. Each day, thousands of eager fans will be hoping to catch a glimpse of the very best high-performance cars in action. But when the sun goes down, you can quickly find yourself in a far more dangerous territory. Welcome to the world of street racing. It's very, Another very dirty underground. Inhabited by daredevils and speed freaks, intent on tearing up the rules and breaking the law. Rising to meet this challenge is Palm City's very own Lieutenant Frank Mercer. Head of the newly formed High Speed Task Force. This is the main man himself. Street racing has no place on public roads. Uh, uh. Mark my words. He looks you terrifying. Are out there and you're engaging in this type of activity. We will find you. And if you think that you can get away by just hitting the gas, then you're in for a surprise. Because we are coming after you hard and we are coming after you fast. Trust me, there is no escape. This man is serious, gives you a theme and the idea what the cops are going to be like. Now, let's go, my friends. It's here. He, I'm so excited to be finally showing it to you. Here we go. There's the beautiful pole star. Here we go. Right, so first event in Need for Speed Heat. We're getting some, some conversation. Some chatting going on, some different. Mate, it's so cool. Jumping right into the city with your crew. Anna's over there, Richie's over here. We're in the pole style with that amazing electric wine that it's got going. Beautiful. It makes hybrids exciting to listen to. And the new NOS system, of course. There's a beautiful city. What a beautiful way to drive into the city. It reminds me of just when you first do those events in Forza. It's the first Swery Mary. I'm serious. He's bad news. Oh, look at it. Everything just looks so good. This is such a good introduction event. You get to see the whole city, everything driving in. Driving in the pole star. Again, not, not some Lamborghini or something or like an Aston Martin. It's a pole star with a big meaty wang on the back. Introducing us to the beautiful city. That we're going to be spending a lot of time in, I can tell you that. Oh, it just looks so good. Everything, every area has its own different lighting. It's the, it's the popo. Got him in my side. Oh! The, the police are serious in this. We've seen from gameplay before. Look out! I'm going 153 miles an hour. And somehow the cops are still passing me like I'm doing nothing. These cops are serious. They want to hunt down these street racers. But so right now we're racing as Joe. And uh, Joe is definitely not me. I am not Joe. But again, Joe, Joe has a nice pulse. This event was difficult. That jumping it, it's difficult to actually get anywhere. I'm stuck in third place at this point. Some cop chatter on the radio. Stuck in third place. These, this race was hard. This game, I, it's difficult, honestly. It's, there's some difficulty to it. And that's very, very nice to know, honestly. I'm very excited about that. And obviously, it starts on medium. You could tone it down. You could turn it up. Which I actually ha haven't done because this is difficult enough right now. And through the perfectly sized robot, I say perfectly sized, you can fit three cars through there. Um, did you see that dirty black car chasing us? I mean, Joe. Here he is. You better run, boy. You better run, he's coming for you. Oh! It's like the M3 all over again. No, 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 my pole star. I mean, Joe's pole star. Joe's pole star. This. No. 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 Okay, it's a little bit different to the M3. We ain't getting that back. <laughs> what did you do? What'd you do with that sweet ass ride? Can I just say, this guy looks like Tyler Morgan. <laughs> he lost the car. He lost the car. No, Tyler Morgan is now this a is policeman. You. You're gonna wish you never survived. Who says he did? It's a bike in need for speed. Holy what? No. What are we doing here? Sending a message. Wait, wait. 
Stop! Hey, hey, he's dead. We're on camera back Don't there. Don't kill him. Shaw, hold it. Are you crazy? So this is how we work now? These crews gotta learn. Try making a mockery of my unit. You're gonna take the fall. So much darker compared to... He deleted the footage! You're smarter than this. You want to send a message? You need a messenger. He deleted the live feed. <laughs> it's so much darker already. Get out of town. And if we see you or any of your crew around here again, you're going to be joining that car. You understand? Yeah, Get yellow out. face man with a mask. Get out of here. We'll tell you Get friends. walking. That's insane. He's he's brutal. He's scary. He's dark. He's just what we needed in Need for Speed. Thank you. Finally. Get that laptop and get out of here. Everybody, get out of here. So I guess these are the main police that we're going to be dealing with throughout this game. And they are terrifying. There's our friend, one of them. In a 350. Watch this scurry. Hey, what happened, bro? Where the hell's your car? Hey, it's in the drink. Yeah, I'm out. I'm going back to Ventura and I'm taking Richie with me. But we're a crew. Not anymore. It's over. What? He, the man just lost his car. Yep. Yeah. He doesn't have You're a on your own. I'm sure he could just go buy another one. If he had a pole style like that, that man has money. Surely it was insured too, right? I'm sure this man can make it work. But <laughs> need for speed heat, baby. We are here in Miami. Sorry, <clears throat> Palm City. Beautiful. Reminds me of a Fast and Furious intro, but we've got speed hunters going on. There is the garage. We're going to be spending so much time in the... <sighs> it's beautiful. It's, it's designed to be spicy and... We've seen we've seen quite a lot of footage of this garage already, but let's let's get in there. What's waiting for us? Other than this this great music, honestly, I quite like the music in this. Oh yes. No, I checked it out. Oh hey, I'll be with you in a sec. Cheers, cheers, mate. Cheers, mate. Keep keep chatting on the phone over there. I'm just yeah, gonna decide what I want. I want that Camaro over there. Yeah. What about you? Look at all the stuff he's got. All the trophies. the TV or the radio it's the news right, cool. oh you know as there important is. as fighting crime is and we are committed to that fight our job is about more than that it's about connecting with you folks out there hearing your story really listening to your concerns that's how we build a better community that's how we build a safer future for Get him out of here! Sorry, it was just a little too much bullshit this early in the day. Oh! <laughs> I hate to do this, but if you're looking for wheels, I got a CID. Cops insist. Alright, I got some ID. Let me just, uh... Let me just... Oh, you mean in the game? I see how it is. Is this where we pick a name? No. Is this where we pick a character? How about yes? That's right. The custom character picker is here now. We get to choose the default character. And that's all we can do as of right now. But that's me. It looks close enough, right? Out of town, huh? I'll take it. Name's Lucas. How can I help? Word is cars out of here can compete. We speak. Our well, name is can. Player. This for the showdown? Back to old need for speeds, yeah, baby. <laughs> I want to get out there and race. Look, I'm not going to lie. The man has been crazy past couple days. So stock's down. But I got these ready to go. They're not top of the line, but... They're good. Good. Once you take a we got to start from the bottom, work our way up. All right, let's have a look, see. So, we've got a Ford Mustang 65. we got the old M3. we got the oh, beautiful 180SX. And we've got so that Camaro like over the there, Japanese which we can't pick. That's his car. Oh. <laughs> so, I'm that Japanese type of guy. You know me, Mr. Skyline, nice Mr. Choice. Nissan Maji. Here we go. Wait to try her out. I know some people at the showdown. See about getting you a race. Perfect time. Perfect sure place to test. Perfect. 
What do you say? Sounds good. I actually like, I really like my character model. Most games, I'm, I'm like, eh, it's okay. This is a decent character model, to be fair. It's pretty close. You can black out the man's hair and we'll be sorted. But <laughs> right now, we need to focus on some racing. We got the 180SX. Let's keep progressing, baby. I want to see how we can make this thing into a beast. Here's okay. the map. Where to? Here we go. You got a couple races to choose from. So a cheeky look the around the map. Is all long curves, and the one Eden Shores is all sharp corners. Take your pick and set a route to it on the map. So this is the day map you may have seen online. It's a little bit different to the actual day map. This is the day day map that you see in the game. It's white instead of the normal map design. I kind of like it. it. It makes it very clear that it's day. And the flames popping already. Here we go. So the first drive. Oh, he's actually in the car as well. Looks like he was good. So everyone says. Showdown's a big deal around here, huh? See, as I said, it was his car. It's great for business. And if you race, you can make some serious bank. Some serious bank. I mean, honestly, yes, I could, especially to upgrade this thing. So this is my first driving experience in the finalish build of the game, and I've got to say, it feels about the same as it did before. I don't know it's much difference. This car is obviously set up as standard. There's no modifications done to this car so far yet. We're doing a little bit of an off-road, you know, testing the off-road. No. <laughs> Amen. Don't, don't, don't mess up, mess with my driving. We're testing out how the handling is, how it reacts. You can see it's a lot more stiff than that of Payback already. We've still got some sliding, but that's with the double clutching. We drive up to the event, start the event. It's got the recommended level and the like. And we got these beautiful, cool cutscenes that you're going to see a lot of in this game. They are so freaking cool to look at. It's just, it just gives you a good light. And some popping off music. Reminds me of GTA music sometimes. Mate, I, I'm really, really, really into the music of this game. It's a nice mix of the kind of Spanish kind of flavor, but also some hip hop, hey, but some trap. With my friend here. And here's Dex. In a new car. If it's one of yours, it's half broke already. Oh. <laughs> nah, man. Mate, better not be broke. I practice races for beginners if you need to get up to speed. Yeah, yeah, funny guy. Very funny. You're always welcome. Here we go, first race. So, this first race doesn't go off without a hitch, <laughs> okay? But anyway, the skyline, this man to the skyline, this is totally unfair already. If this man doesn't win, there's already some issues to be discussed. But straight away, getting a feel for the city, the first race is in the city. That was one of the complaints I had about Need for Speed Payback because there's no actual city events other than the beginning of the game. I mean, we already had the beginning of the game. Now I feel like this is it. Uh, it cut off. Um, yeah, so that that wasn't great. I, I paused the game, and of course we're on all drive, so we ended up in six because it keeps playing an all drive. You can play single player, but we call back up to where we were. No, I don't. No, I don't quit. So I'm in second place right now. The skyline wasn't in first actually. I think it crashed at the beginning of the event, so that's the only reason the skyline isn't winning. Because otherwise, I think he should. So, right now, I'm pulling some skids by double tapping the clutch. Clutch kicking, as you know, is the new way of doing it. Sometimes I'm trying not to drift to see how it performs. But there's a few things I want to talk about about the handling, which I'll do in a dedicated video. But as you can see, if you're kind of heading towards a wall, just double press that button. Get into that slide, and you're definitely going to fix that problem. And I actually, did I say I passed the skyline? That sounds pretty pretty close to a skyline. I may have been... Yeah, I'm wrong. The skyline is ahead. <laughs> Apparently, I can't read. The skyline was ahead. We'll pass him. We'll boost pass him right at the end of the event. That's how you do. And as I said, it, it's kind of difficult, this game. There's a bit of difficulty to it. And the races pop in as they finish the event themselves. 13750 for a reward. It sounds like a lot of money. In all Need for Speeds, I say all the, the last few goes Need for Speeds, that would have been about five grand, I think. Then take care of it. Ooh. I guess we'll do that then. So, yes, there is a garage and a part shop.
That takes some mula. That makes total sense. That ain't the whole story, but it's the basics. And step one for you is find that nitrous kit. Yeah, so Need for Speed feels a little bit odd without NOS. Aftercare comes as standard. Doesn't matter how great a driver you are. Everyone needs a good mechanic. And that's you, huh? You want to take on Palm City by yourself? Be my guest. Just saying, it's easier when someone's got your back. That's true. If you head into the parts shop, you might as well swing by the old raceway. Now he's talking about the over racetrack, but uh, unfortunately, I'm already here. How come it closed? <laughs> so you're gonna have to stop <laughs> because, mate, I'm about to start a cutscene. Apparently, let's go. Takes <laughs> taking a little second, but here we go. So, yes, we want that nos part pretty badly. <laughs> Open up! Give me the nos. I really do need it. Nos, nos. Having no nos in the speed is very, very strange. But obviously, you gotta upgrade it. You gotta buy it. That character model looks really good, honestly. I can hear you in there. I feel like it's better oh, than yeah. most. <laughs> Did Lucas sell you this? Yeah. You know him? You could say that. He's my brother. Oh. That used to be mine. Oh really? My first Did you damage it like this? She's perfect for someone just starting out. Fair enough. Hey, you mind telling me what their deal is? Oh, stock is limited around town because of the showdown. They're only selling if they know you're going to put the parts to good use. Who says I won't? That's fair. Okay. Lucas got confidence. So you got to show them then. I've got a chance to prove you're more than just talk. Let's do it. Give me your phone. Already the story feels a little, like, a lot better. I'm it's Anna. a lot more down to oh, the point of what people want. Thank you. I got your number. I gotta make some calls. You stay on that thing. I'll be in touch. Was that a Honda? It sounded like a Subaru. <laughs> Is that a car or a trumpet? <laughs> I'm sorry, if you own a 350, I apologize. But that was the test drive. That was the introduction basically complete, I imagine. Like, sure, there's more of it. But there's the live tuning menu. We've got to have a look at. And there's the messages. And you can actually set the route using the text message, which is really, really good. Thanks. Cop scanner would be useful. Anyway. On to the next objective. Oh, it's Dex again. Thanks, Lucas. Oh, Stop giving everyone my number. Awesome, awesome, awesome. <sighs> it's so cool. So this is the, obviously the outer side of the city. It's where the more, uh, I don't know, the, the chilled out area is. Just chill. No city. Just chilling, pools, chillaxing, relaxing, whatever you want to do. <laughs> anyway, so yeah, the game looks beautiful. The game looks very, very, very flawed. And as you can see, the roads are currently not wet, which is something that's very clearly, like, it's just to demonstrate the game and how it looks good. And one thing that's really cool, a lot of the time in this game, it'll rain so randomly and suddenly and then stop. And that reminds me so much of Florida in general. It's so good. Anyway. So we're gonna see a nice transition here. We're, we're in the day, obviously. We're gonna wait for this baby. She is more in the night and we're doing a night mission. So we do the swap, we do the do, and you can actually do that. You can just switch in the, the missions themselves. It's super cool. It flew by. <laughs> That's funny. Where are we going? And some of the music, as I said, the music's different in the night than the day. Anyway. So we're doing a follow mission, which is awesome. Like, it's so character, but I don't know about you, but and she tells you which way to go. And they indicate which way they're going a lot of the time as well. I don't know if she does, but they do. And again, it's just it's just so character building. You're not getting anywhere without one. You want to spend all that show down bank on better parts? Yeah. Oh really? Somewhere. 
Dude lost his nerve years ago. Leave him alone. Maybe he's maybe he's a smart one. Maybe you're the stupid one. Maybe. Also, <laughs> she didn't tell me which way she was going. You, the thing is with these follow it, I feel like they go a little bit slow to begin with. And then someone's just appeared. Uh oh. That sounds like some relationship beef to me. Oh, really? <laughs> I love how aggressive she gets as soon as he appears. Take a right. I... We go skr skr to the right. She's sliding everywhere. So we're going to finish this race. Then she's going to give us some deets. As you can see at the top of the screen, that's our heat level in the night. That's the focus. Rep. Getting that rep. Now, rep, you can gain from doing events. Or you can gain from, I guess, probably the cop stuff, right? Uh, and once you finish the night, that's when you get it. You lose the multiplier. I'm going to try to film you while we're driving. Hope you get a good shot of my rear end. <laughs> Okay then. No, uh, as you as you lose, if you lose in the night, the pursuit ends. Then you lose your multiplier. You still get red, but you lose your. It's not as aggressive as rivals. But look at this. Look at people's customized cars. They've actually got liveries and wraps and designs and bits and it's so good. That Civic is among my my favorite. Her name is Monica. It's absolutely perfect. And the night racing commences, and it looks so good. The difference between the two. Oh, it's so good in the music. It's just instantly like, welcome to night. We race serious over here. Oh, I love it. I love it. I love it. I'm, I'm going to do my best to keep the music on during the Let's Play because it's just so awesome to listen to. It's just so, it, it fits the mood so, so well. But anyway, already in first place, as I said, it was a little bit strange in the last events I wasn't doing great, but now I'm doing amazing. Maybe it's because it's my car and I can do what I want with it. I know what I'm doing. But no, this car felt awesome. Obviously, I don't have the nicest upgrade yet because <laughs> I couldn't get it. But again, it's nice to have a stock, stock car and then actually put the time in, the money in, the effort in. Yeah, yeah, sure you are. Keep trying. Keep trying. Try and catch up to me. But it feels nice actually putting the time and effort into your car. And it doesn't take very long before we actually start upgrading. In fact, we're pretty close. We're pretty close, I feel. I mean, we got 13 grand for our first event and we just finished our first night race to get a thousand rep. Sure, I did. Get out of here. Who do you think you are, mister? Make sure to tag me, baby. Yeah, I like it all. Look at the 488. That's so good. Look at the skyline. That's your answer. One day, one day we will be in the league. It's kind of like the blacklist, right? Surely that's what I'm. That's the vibe I'm kind of getting there. And there's a Florida rain. Oh. Okay, and I believe we're in West Side. So yeah, that's not great. The cops already on their way to chase me. So the map up there, as you can see, it's different in the night. Yeah, you should join us. Look at the neons of the, the gas stations. It's so good. Everything just fits super, super well in this game. Super clean. It just fits super well. The vibe is so much better straight away than Payback. You can already tell we've only been playing here for about 25 minutes, but 
the vibe is so much, so, so much better. Anyway, here is the next vape, vape, vape event. And uh, yeah, we're, we're perfect for it. So you can actually do the events all drive if you want to. You don't have to. Um, you can play single player or you can invite friends or you can invite your crew members only. It's got some cool invites options here. And some banging tunes. It feels like proper street race. The vibes are just so good. It gets me pumped for the event, but I'm also popping flames in a stock car. Someone's done something. Someone's done a cheeky remap on my car, that's for sure. I'm your style, yeah, I'm going for another event. Wow, I ain't done yet. You think I'm done on one level heat? One Heat level one, that's nothing. That's nothing. You can see cops starting to appear on our mini-map now as well, which is it's kind of terrifying. I mean, the cops, we've not been against them just yet. In fact, we have in the Pulsar, but it wasn't. It was just an introduction event. This would be our first experience with the police. So I'm, I'm playing it safe here. I'm playing it safe. We're going to avoid those police. We're going to win this race. And we're probably going to run away. <laughs> we're going to run away and hide back into the garage. But yes, I'm loving this so far. The vibe is there. The handling is... At times, it's a little bit interesting. <laughs> It's a little bit interesting, but again, we've not really delved into the customization of the upgrades yet, which we will be doing. I promise you, I'm going to have a lot of that stuff to go through. But no, this instantly, the, you feel it from looking at it. It looks and feels a million times better. But straight away, I'm smashing it. We need to bump up. Do we need to bump up the difficulty? I don't know. Maybe we need to bump up to, to the hard difficulty. There's a policeman. The first police chase. And our first listen of the police chase music. I almost missed that corner. <laughs> Pretend that I didn't. First idea of the police chase music. They are very aggressive. Already ramming me. Already trying to spin me out. And already, already I'm losing them. <laughs> Again, stage one cops. I span that man out. I'm in an event. I feel like they come. They don't come after you as hard. Now you should really think about getting off the street. Probably, yeah. And I feel like, again, because it's the introduction, it's not as aggressive. And I can tell you, I've been against the more aggressive cops and they get aggressive. So here we are. And uh, we can keep racing in the night. There wasn't really any events for me to do. So let's jump back to one of the uh, safe spots. There's actually a few safe houses and the garage is the main safe house. So the safe houses, I'm, they just, they're just places for you to hide out. Uh, they're not garages. Which is, it's just interesting. It's very interesting. So the cops are still looking for me. But we need to get home. We need to get hidden. We need to get away. If we if we got busted now, we would lose all of our night progress. I mean, most of our night progress. Lose the amount of rep. And as you see at the top of the screen, we are currently heat level one. And we got another cop chase on us already. And if we bank now, we will be heat level four in the first night. I think that's pretty good enough. Uh, how about you leave me alone? Yeah, that's me. That's me. If you could uh, stop calling me and let me uh, escape, I gotta escape these police. I want. I want to get banked all my money. I want to start spending some money on upgrades on this. This this 180, this 240, whatever you want to call it. She needs some loving. The cop health is already down. He must have spun out and crashed into the wall or something. And I'm gonna give him one little love tap, and he's probably gonna be down. He's gonna be down for the count. He's gonna be vamosed, gone, deleted. He's still running really far away, but he's gonna try and brake check me or something. Do a cheeky power slide. What you gonna do now? You're gonna fall behind. Almost hit that car, what? That's insane, and we've escaped. He lost us going down a straight road. There's a safe house, pull a quick skid. Nah, it's too late. It's already over, the night has ended. And I've wrecked my car quite a lot. <laughs> so we got, uh, that was some money there. We actually got some money for the night there. I think there's some challenges you can do that actually give you money in the night, but there's the multiplier. We got the heat multiplier times two. So the rep increases and, and our rep level is going up to level four. Actually, it's gone up to level three. Interesting. Interesting. Not what I expected. Anyway, so that is going to conclude episode one 
of Need for Speed Heat. Hopefully you enjoyed. I'm going to be back again later and over the next few days posting more Need for Speed Heat for you. We're going to see over the next few days basically how everything compiles and if this is the best Need for Speed in a long time. And I've got to tell you, I feel like it actually might be. Be sure to smash like, subscribe if you are new, and I will see you in the next video. Peace.